Hello guys, hello people. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on the place and the time when I for the watch me today. I greet everybody in the house. If not the first time where they come across my video be this, or you they watch my video before you never subscribe, wait till you they wait for follow me, press that button when it says subscribe. And if you don't already subscribe, I say thank you. God go bless you now. Well, well for me, my people. Me could not forget to press the like button and the notification button. So anytime when I put any program, you damn go the first people will come see them. The matter who carry come to the about this our pastor, this prophet, he's saying see vision about America. He said problem won't happen for America. He said Casala won't prove America. He said waiting go up for America if you are not join and pray for America. So come eh? if you know so you get brother or you get sister for America, I beg, join us. Pray for America. I don't know one thing about this prophet and this pastor. Now me, they help him, they broadcast the news. Anytime, because since I see vision, where, where? Uh -huh. In case, if you never know, they follow my YouTube, you could see prophecy. This is our brother, so this is our pastor. In the see prophecy, where, where? In the always they see. So anytime when you see me, at that universe, go follow and broadcast some. Uh -huh. So I'm waiting a day for you. So, so this time when you just come and say, you don't see something, you, at that universe, there to help and broadcast some. So my people, Listen, as I talking before, he don't see another prophecy. He don't see another vision. So I beg, eh? if you know so you get brother or sister or family for America, follow us and this pastor. Pray. Make something not go happen to America. Say because if we not pray, the country will go happen for America. It's not be small. So make we pray, make we no want make anything happen to go. No, so we get people for America. <laughs> one or two people get. If you like, you know, get see join us, pray. <laughs> or you follow or share the video, go meet person when you get person for America. Because we don't want me something happen for America. But before you go, listen, follow me for my Facebook page. Sonia Talk and Go. I have the name of my Facebook page. Now, make sure not forget to leave on our comments. Make you not person and make only talk, talk, talk. They talk too much. I don't want to waste on our time. I make sure I just talk small. Make a live on her. Now, what I go do? Make sure I listen to this prophet by myself. Me could not hear them from the horse's mouth. Me could not be seen at me, they talk him. And if you watch and finish, you can't feel say you get anything we won't contribute for this matter. Me could not forget to leave on a comment for the comment station. And me could not help me share my video. At that universe, I say thank you again. I will see you again for my next video. Thank you guys and God bless. Bye. Red. God, begin to take me in the realm of the spirit is a place called the United States of America. Canada, I see myself right now in the U.S. And I begin to ask myself, what am I doing in the U.S.? And the Lord say, I want to show you something that is already in the realm of the spirit. And I begin to ask, what is this that is in the realm of the spirit? I hear a voice that tell me to say to America to buckle up their clothes. Oh my God. I don't want to be talking about this all the time because there are so many things I want to talk about. But I don't know why the spirit is now moving me straight away to another man's country. That's not my country. But there is a special love upon the country. Because whoever God loves, God will always speak to that person. I see myself in the United States of America. And the Lord began to say, intercession needs to be made for that country. Not only intercession, God said the people that are praying for the country, United States of America, should wake up on their stand and make more intercession for the country. They should begin to intercede for the country, begin to pray for the country, United States of America, because of their enemies. And I look at the American countries and American continent and American states and begin to see in the realm of the spirit where the enemy of America strike America. Where are they striking them? What is the problem? And who is this person that is behind this striking? These are the questions that need to be asked in the realm of the physical to be able to ascertain. And I begin to ask myself, what is this? Is this another World Trade Center attack? Or what is it that we're going to call this one? And the Lord opened my eyes and said, the enemies want to make them cry. So, the world is enough for the wise. And the reason of this world is not as if I am trying to just speak. I am calling a special prayer request. 
a prayer point for those that are under intercession because in the realm of the spirit often and often god has shown me people that are interceding in different places praying lifting up the banner lifting up the the, the, the flags lifting up great things he said these people that are praying should go more and pray for united states of america pray for the country because i see where the enemies now strike them strike and attack the country united states of america and god said prayer must be said for this country because the reason why prayer must be said because they are christian country they are people that want to stand for the justice want to stand for peace want to stand for what is good and the right of fellow human being because of this their enemies have strike their enemies striked and i say this enemy that is striking this country what will we do to them and god said the only thing to be done is for the people to pray it's for the people to pray and the western world especially the european nations should pray i am seeing a lot of what is called this is called disaster but disaster must be arrested in the name of jesus they should pray for western countries i don't know why all of these things are befallen but all i know there is a god in heaven that is capable of delivering his people but the issue of this america must be taken serious it's not an issue that the people will just overlook and say